the first time that you launch the sixth client and log in, you'll be prompted to set up six. If you choose to ignore this step or accidentally click no, whoops, don't worry, you can always access the quick setup page via the start menu, setup, quick setup. This page has links to common settings uh, regarding your company, clients, your catalog of products, uh, projects in six, as well as reports. Now, uh, you're not required to set all of this stuff up right now. Uh, it'd be a good idea to go through this now uh, because it's, it's going to get you started using six. For instance, you may want to enter your um, company name and your address and add your logo for use on our reports. Um, another example here would be uh, defining your phases. Uh, if you're going to be charging labor on a per item basis, meaning you add a product to a uh, project, and the labor will automatically be calculated for you based on the phase rates uh, times the number of hours, you're going to want to go ahead and put your rates out here for what you charge uh, per phase of the job. Another good one would be defining your tax rates here. So when you start working inside of six, that the projects are charging the proper tax. Uh, you can always, again, access this at any time via the start menu, setup, quick setup. You can also go to the control panel. There's also a link right on this page to that. Now, the control panel has a full listing of the settings in six. So you can always come back and revisit this, make changes as needed.